Pues nada, muchas gracias a todos por participar. Ha sido un placer eh, estar aquí con vosotros. Mm, gracias especialmente a todos los que habéis eh, intervenido, sea desde aquí o sea desde, desde el público. Eh, espero que el año que viene podamos contar de nuevo con vosotros. Y sin, sin eh, entretenerme más, doy paso a Carol Wyant, que, que va simplemente a, a, dirigiros, a, a dirigirse a vosotros muy brevemente en nombre de, del Richard Isdrichor Charitable Dick Trust. Thank you, Alejandro, and I will be brief, but I wanted to offer to you all an opportunity or a challenge, uh, and, and to, I hope you take this as a, a chronology of an idea. Um, 17 years ago, Richard Driehaus had an idea, and he wanted to draw attention uh, across the world to traditional architecture and urbanism. And so he established a prize, the Drury House Prize for Classical Architecture, he called it. And uh, he gave that prize in 2010 to Rafael Manzano Marto. You've heard his name and maybe heard him speak yesterday. Uh, and so uh, when Rafael came and, and Richard learned from Rafael that uh, there were not everyone in Spain, where Rafael has been working for many years, uh, understood the value and the importance of tradition, the new traditional architecture. And so Richard said, well, all right, I have another idea. We're going to establish the Manzano Prize for classical architecture, or new traditional architecture. And so that began, and out of that idea came doing a seminar uh, at the Polytechnic School, and then we decided to do the summer school that Alejandro just spoke of. And uh, to make all this happen, I was able to pull together a team of very talented, very amazing people, including Alejandro, but, but also many others uh, who, within Spain, have been working, Rebecca, very much. <laughs> and. Um, But, so we have built a team of very talented, very knowledgeable pe people who also know many other people. So we're beginning, you know, there's a nucleus going on here. So then out of that came partnerships. Uh, one of the team members, Natalia Escalada, who is a very talented communicator. She was editor of many newspapers and many things. And, and, people were not hearing about the Manzano Prize, and so she came on the team, and it just turns out that Natalia knows lots of people, uh, and because of her knowledge and her connections, we ended up with these partnerships with the Ministry of Culture and Sport and the Ministry of Fomento here in, in Spain, saying, well, Can we partner with you? You're doing some interesting things. We have ideas. Let's, let's work together on more ideas. And that, that then became uh, the uh, Building Arts Awards. And you, you heard from one of the winners earlier today but with the metal work. Um, uh, and, and then also we, this, the architecture competition. So, um, and of course, Intbau, uh, almost everyone we've been working with has also been involved with Intbau, and Intbau has become a very valuable partner of our team. So, um, I, I just leave with you that uh, with an idea, you can end up with a network of people who then know other people all over the world, and I believe we have we are creating together a movement of people who will share ideas with one another and, and then share those ideas with many other people. We will never know it happened, but it keeps growing and growing. And so I just offer to you that you can do the same. Have an idea and follow it and see how far you can make it go and the difference you can make.
a last word. All this wouldn't be possible without Caro. 